Okay, so welcome back to Scrap Mechanic. I have allowed Kitty to create his own spaceship, um, and if it's good enough, we'll use it in the KKK space program. So, um, Kitty the cat, show us what you got. Oh, um, well, you get a You Tried sticker. I feel like you're patronizing me. That's because I am, Kitty. Yeah, you did a great job, buddy. I'm really, really proud of you. Uh, yeah, let's see how this drives. You did it! You made a scrap mac- we, We're in space, Kitty! We're in space! Look! Oh, isn't this beautiful? It's space! You're a disappointment to you and your entire family. The Ship Rover 9000. That's what I'm naming it. Th 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 that's what you get. Alright, anyway, uh, we need to train our body to be able to take the horrible and death-defying pain of, of space, I think. I don't know, I didn't listen to physics. So of course we have our takeoff point up here, which we built last episode. Uh, but now, underneath here, look! Oh, all these different rooms! So first of all, we're going to want to get our body prepared for the enormous G-forces that we are going to feel in outer space. I think I saw this in a movie once, so... It'll go perfectly! Oh yes, by the way, remember how ugly this place was from the outside? Well, I covered it in uh, metal stuff, so it's slightly less ugly now. It's still kind of ugly though. So yeah, I updated the mod pack, um, and oh my god, there is so much- <laughs> there's so many more blocks in this thing. Whoa, water block? What the fuck? Oh wow, they made- oh wow, there's water! Water block! That is pretty dope. Oh wow, look, I can build Lego! Ah! Okay, well this one should be pretty simple, uh, pretty easy to get with. So here we go, let's just- Jesus Christ! My organs are being ripped out! Ah! Oh, that was a fun ride. Well, I think all of our uh, bones have now been loosened to the point of actually coming out of our body. But now we have no bones to crush from the G-Force, so I think, I, think, I think we learned some good lessons there. This next test is all about heat. How much heat can we stand? Because uh, in our ship, a slight bit of the atmospheric fires might come just in between the ship, so we're just going to see if we can take a tiny bit of burn. JESUS CHRIST! It burns! It burns! Mm. Mm. Charred tongue actually tastes quite good. Mm. This show is very quickly becoming a comedy parody of Saw. This next test is about seeing how much force our character can take. So, there is a chance we might get hit by uh, tiny asteroids while we're out there in space. So let's just test and see if we can handle that. JESUS CHRIST! So while we're out there in space, our ship could be hit with something. So we're going to want to check that our scrap mechanic character can take some f That one ended a little bit prematurely, but you get the idea, it works. I guess that's all that's left now is to actually build the spaceship. Our body seems pretty ready to go. Yeah, he looks fine. So they actually put in a spaceship block, which looks really cool. But why the hell would I use this if it's a heavy weight? It's never gonna fly! Introducing the official KKK Space Something. Now, I know it's a little bit small, but uh, unlike some people, <coughs> Elon Musk, I'm not compensating for anything. So this thing basically only needs to go up, since that's where we're going. So as long as it can do that, then uh, we're doing good. So let's do it. Press the wrong button. Let's try this one. Ugh. Okay, so we're back. Okay, this time I hopefully it'll actually fly. Okay. Let's go. Holy shit! We're off to space! This doesn't look like space. That is not the direction of space. That is not the direction of space. Listen. Listen. Oh, shit! like disguised as a rock. No one will see me here. <laughs> so I've added some micro thrusters that should, uh, see, look, so now we can choose which direction we go. All right, let's see if this will fly. It's going. Oh, no, wait, wrong way. There you go. Keep it going. There you go. Keep it going up. Yes, I've managed to master space travel. Here we go, boys. K Karen did it. You, 
You you made the spaceship fly. I'm so proud of you. Kitty, that's really nice of you to say. Kitty, is that the first nice thing you've ever said to me? And I will finally destroy you. <laughs> You're an asshole and no one likes you. Don't stop. It's always funny when Kieran cries. Hey, Kieran, lick my balls. Wait a second. You've never been nice to me. Kitty's not nice. No. Kitty's an asshole. You're not Kitty. <sighs> okay. I'm sorry for lying. What? What an amazing twist. Is this an M. Night Shyamalan movie? I, I was a hairball that your cat threw up. I guess for some reason the magic power that gave him the ability to speak to you through animation somehow passed on to me. So, where's Kitty? He's dead. You never feed him. Oh yeah. Oh shit, we're coming in for landing. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh no! The door is... Oh. Fuck! Why is it that every time I get to a place, I have to crash into it? Oh shit, it is dark! Is this the moon? Is there any way that I can have like a flashlight? I need like a flashlight. I guess this is the moon. Kinda looks like the moon. I think we're on the dark side of the moon though. Oh shit! Um, also, I don't know how we're gonna get back, judging by the fact that this thing uh, is, is quite fucked. I think we crashed it pretty hard. Well, first things first, we're gonna need a Mars rover. Mar Mars rover? Moon rover. M M Mars rover, I don't know. There, now it's a little bit brighter. Man, thank God that they added lights to Scrap Mechanic. <laughs> or I don't know what you do while you're on the moon, you just kind of be like, well, this is the moon. Oh good, okay. Best rover ever made. It's like a pop-out rover, did you see that? Do you have a mini- Oh, and it pops out! <laughs> okay, and on the back of this thing here, I'm gonna install a little computer who can chat to us. Hello, computer? Hello, KGamer69. Oh shit, this is cool. Okay, uh, computer, how long are the days on the moon? An average day on the moon lasts 476 hours. Shit! We're gonna be stuck in the dark until we get back. Why did I even come to the moon? Why, why was this even- why did anyone think this would be a good idea? Oh yeah, this is sick, this is- <laughs> Oh, I'm such a fucking colossal failure. Okay, well I guess we're gonna- we're gonna make the entrance to the, uh, the moon base. Right about here, this seems- this seems good. Okay, here we go. Let's just get it inside. Oh, for fuck's sake! <laughs> Why can't I build anything that works? My buggy won't even fit in my hole. That sounded weird. Okay, well all the oxygen's about to run out, so we're just gonna have to leave the buggy outside and just live in here. <clears throat> so this is the new show, everyone. We've run out of oxygen. We can't go outside. Uh, for the next 600 episodes, we're just gonna sit here <clears throat> and uh, literally twiddle our thumbs. Picture yourself in a boat on a river with tangerine trees and If you guys did enjoy this video, please like the video. It really helps. Press that fucking notification button. Don't just subscribe because subscribing is useless now. You gotta you gotta click that button. So yeah, if you wanna help out and support the channel, make sure to just hit the bell! <laughs>